Today I am going to the movies to see Spider-Man Homecoming. I'll let you know how it is. Oscars Odyssey. Oscars Odyssey. We just got out. Spider-Man 2. Oh no, it's Spider-Man the new one. Where are you walking away from? What did you think about it? Good movie. Good movie? It's really funny. Oh yeah? Why are you trying to get off the camera? I'm trying to get close. He's camera shy. Look at him back there. He's so camera shy. He doesn't want to be in the camera. Look at him how upset he is. I don't want to be on camera. Spider-Man Homecoming. That was so good. Are you hungry? Yeah. Yeah. Me too. Ooh, what is this? Spider-Man, Spider-Man, does whatever a Spider-Man can. Hey, Charlie, do you know who I am? Spider-Man? No. I'm me, stupid. Charlie, you know what bothers me at Toy Stores? What? Just a little while ago, when you were making a poop, I was over here. Don't put that in there. I'm gonna put that in there. And this lady goes, Is this the Flash? No. Is that the Flash? Oh. Is this the Flash? That didn't happen. Yes, yeah, she was. She was doing that to this little kid. Is that the Flash? All the way on down the line, picking up the rock, picking up clearly not the Flash. That's the rock. Is this the flash? It was super duper annoying. And look, I'm talking with a toothpick in my mouth. People were asking me, how do you do that? They don't know how to talk with toothpicks in their mouth? Apparently not. It's a Texas thing, I guess. But anyway, oh, hold on, Charlie. Is this the flash? What's wrong with your hair? Nothing's wrong with it. <laughs> Hair's great. <laughs> It's not. It looks like a messed up Swiffer. Look at your hair. It's just slicked back because my hat. I gotta get a haircut. Look at that. Yeah, try. So, Spider Man, seriously. Hold on. Is this the Flash? You <laughs> can't even see it. It's King Kong. Yeah, but you, can, you were just seeing it. Is that the Flash, Charlie? Is that better? <laughs> Idiot. Telling me how to vlog. What's um, telling you? I thought Spider-Man was freaking awesome. It was really good. No spoilers here. No spoilers coming for me. But Except. it is definitely the best movie in the Marvel Cinever Cin Cinematic Universe. Cineverse. That should be a word. Cineverse. Write that down. Nah. Oh, see, my, this is my little brother, Charlie. Look at his packs. Look at those things. Bump them. Bump them. <laughs> he, he made his boobies bounce. That's so funny. Oh. That's funny, but anyway, scale of one to ten, Spider-Man, Homecoming. Eight and a half. He's so mean, I'm gonna give it a ten. It was so good. And Aunt May, I was telling him in the car, how weird is it that when you go see a Spider-Man movie to think that Aunt May is the hot girl in the movie? That is so insane to me. But Aunt May, Marissa Tomei, mm-mm-mm. Tasty burger, what do you think, Charlie? Zendaya was... No, wrong, false, bad answer. Marissa Tomei. That's a, that's a tasty boiga right there, as I like to say. Now, went the wrong way. Come back. Come back. What are you, what are you drinking there? Is that what you drink in order to, to stay healthy? Is that what you drink? I don't even know what this is. Yeah, it's, this is for Tamatoa. This is for Tamatoa. My Hermie crab, he ran out of water. I need to spritz him as soon as I get home. Yes, I have a hermit crab. He doesn't watch my vlogs. Hold this. He's just dumb muscle. That's what I bring him around for. She's not smarter than me. Nobody's smarter than me. Ugh. Spider Man. Let's go pick up Charlie and go to Toys R Us. What do you think? I mean, Charlie? Yeah, dude. Sorry. We, I have the toothpick because we just ate. 
a lot. How was Willie's? Pretty good. Would you say you love Willie's? No. <laughs> I like it. Do you like Willie's? <laughs> Would you say you like Willie's? I like Willie's. <laughs> That's so funny. Okay, let's go to Toys R Us. Okay, I'm going to be completely honest with you guys. I totally forgot to film inside of Toys R Us yesterday. And I did say yesterday because that was a completely another day. So I kind of screwed up. Didn't figure out an ending to that vlog. So I'm just going to continue with what I'm doing today. Which is making a short film with my buddy Jeff. Hey Jeff, ready to make a movie? Hi! Sure. Carl's Jr. is where me and Jeff come when we want to get our best ideas because this is where we've always come to get our best ideas when we were working. Now, I think we sat in this booth before. We've always, we always sit in this booth or that booth right there. These are our idea booths. So if you're ever at this Carl's Jr., back up. Eat your food. Eat your food. Eat your food. Okay, anyway. We have to come up with an idea because the idea that I had, Jeff, I had I had an actor and a backup actor involved. Ready. <laughs> we're, we're ready. The actor and the backup Hello, actor. Hey, be quiet. I had an actor and a backup actor, and guess what happened? They got sick. They both fell through. Isn't that typical? That's typical. I don't want to say on the camera. Okay, well, but I'll tell you this. I'll, I'll tell you this. Hold on. Yeah, of course. Of course they would back out. They always back out. Anyway, we come here, we come up with our ideas. This is what we have, Jeff. We have me, an awesome director, and a, and a package. Him, I'm gonna try to drop off somewhere. I pick it up. When I, I pick up the box, like, what the heck? Over the shoulder, spin it around. Yeah. And then you look around, and then you walk off frame. Uh -huh. Like, I keep the camera still. Yeah. You walk off frame, then we cut back to your car, you walk up to your car, put it down, you're looking at it, and then you pick out your phone, you dial, uh -huh. and then we, obviously we can't shoot yeah. those things here, yeah. but you dial, yeah. and then we, the dialogue, whatever Do we want to do gunshot be, things? Like I pick no, it no, up no, 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 make it cheesy. Okay. Okay. I want it to be cinematic, realistic. Okay. Okay, let's so, get... Yeah. So, without you being in it, just kind of like, shoot a like, shot of the water, maybe some close-ups to like, some trees or something, mm -hmm. and then, and then, like, the, sh the shot that I'm imagining is like, shooting the water and then, like, a cut out, like a zoom out from yeah. that, and then you're sitting here next to the water, and then that's where we started. What about these crawfish? Can they be in the can they be in the movie? No. Just scouting the location at the park for this little short that we're gonna try to shoot. Hopefully it looks good. Hopefully it looked good, because you're gonna see this already. This is the next day's video. Oh, but yeah, we're getting the gear. We've been here for about almost an hour setting up gear and stuff like that. It's been a long time since I've set up the camera for you know, filmmaking stuff. So I was a little out of practice, but I got it all set up. Jeff was, we were down there talking about the uh, shots that we're gonna take. Jeff's a pretty competent director. The best director I've worked with besides myself. So I trust him for this project. Uh, yeah, let's, let's get it started. Okay, so right over there is the spot that we originally scoped out to shoot this little short. And when we went to go get the camera gear, we got taken. People showed up and they stole our spot. Here's a little tip in filmmaking. Always have a backup. Me and Jeff here, seasoned filmmakers. Seasoned. So we knew, okay, let's not let us take us down. Let's go around and find another spot. Let's find a better spot. And guess what? We found a better spot right here. I vlogged here. That's the tree I vlogged at when my uncle died. You guys remember that when my uncle died? When my uncle died? Yeah. Anyway, this is the spot that we are gonna shoot the short in. Jeff's getting some, some B-roll over there with the Black Magic Cine camera. Uh, right here is actually a little behind the scenes stuff. This is actually the first spot Jude ever fished with my dad. We bring Jude and my, my nieces and everybody over here. And this is where we, this is where we uh, learned how, that's where he learned how to fish. Look at Jeff, he's directing back there, he's filming. He looks legit. 
Okay, I gotta get back to work so Jeff doesn't get mad at me. And those are some of the great things at San Antonio Parks. Like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you next time. Okay, we're about to shoot. Been doing some test shoots, couldn't get it, couldn't get the, the image we wanted. We're gonna shoot in raw. I hope that doesn't hurt us. Okay, ready? So what do you want me to do? I'm going to do my lines, and do you want me to walk off? Or do you want me just yeah. to stay? Okay. And those are just some of the great things in San Antonio Parks. Like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you next time. Just getting the wide shot. You'll see all action when you're ready. That's what it is on set. Hurry up and wait. What you gotta do? Oh, there we go. And those are just some of the great things in San Antonio Parks. Like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you next time. Another take. I forgot to turn the audio on on the first one. And those are just some of the great things in San Antonio Parks. Like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you next time. How hard is filmmaking? Really hard. Yeah, you forgot? You're out of, you're well, out of touch? I've never used this camera before, it's heavy. I know, but it's heavy. <laughs> The five, the three pound camera is heavy. It is, right? That's what that's what I always respected about uh, Freddie W and uh, what's his name? The guy that was his friend that they're not together no more? Brandon. Brandon. Is Brandon will always go to the gym because he said, people don't understand working out. It's it's heavy to carry the damn um, camera. Do the kitlins. Yeah. Kitlins. And Jeff and I's little two man film team guy group thing, filmmaker. He's the director, sometimes has ideas, sometimes has really good ideas. I'm usually a writer, uh, the cinematographer, I usually set up the camera and the lights and stuff like that in between shots. I'm going back to help Jeff and adjust the camera settings and everything like that. But together, it makes such a good director. I'm more like a Kevin Smith kind of director, like a Jared Hess kind of guy. And uh, he's like a Christopher Nolan type. We just get along. It's perfect. It's like peanut butter and jelly, like milk and honey. Look at him getting that B-roll. We gotta roll that beautiful bean footage. Look at that getting shots. I hope I can use some of it. Ooh, there's a lot of pollen in the air. Can you guys see it? Can you see it float? You guys? I don't think you can. Uh, I guys. I hope you guys really like this. It's a lot of work. Kind of haven't shot anything like this in a long time, and people forget that it takes a lot of work to do something like this. Jeff the Trooper, Looks like a sniper with a weird gun. Can you slide that over? Stand that back up. Look at that. Um, back it up a little bit. Setting up shots. Look at that. Like a pro. Like a pro. Like a pro. Look at that, like a sniper. <laughs> You're not hiding from nobody. As you can imagine, it's really fun on set with me and Jeff. Ugh. Sorry, I had to lift that. Is it recording? That sucks. You're all dirty. Yeah. That's what you get. It's called filmmaking, brah. It's called filmmaking, brah. We just wrapped at the park. Look, Jeff. Look at him with the camera. We just wrapped. We got to do some stuff in the van. Some some little stuff, and then we got to go back to my house, my dad's house, and shoot Jeff's part. 
since we're a two man team. We don't have actors. Nope. We don't even need actors. We nope. just we're just the, all the actors in our own movies. Forget it. The good old days. Yeah, take that, uh, Eddie Murphy. <laughs> and from the park to the pool, we are done with this shoot. How do you feel, Jeff? Tired. I know, it's really hot. exhausting and it's hot. Sweaty. Jeez Louise. We it's should just really move hot. to California and make movies. The weather's it's so much better. There. Dude, 78 with no humidity. It's expensive. Feels tasty. Will somebody pay for us to come out there and make movies? Okay. That was it. I hope you like I hope you liked this short. I showed it to you yesterday. Um, like, comment, and subscribe. And maybe we will see you next time. Bye. Bye.